Have you ever heard about the Duchy of Brunswick Lüneburg? A historical gem tucked away in northwestern Germany, this duchy emerged in the year 1235 from the lands of the House of Wealth. It was a realm of power, granted as an imperial fief to Otto the Child, and it stood as a testament to the ever-changing landscapes of political and territorial boundaries in medieval Europe. The duchy was divided several times among various lines of the House of Wealth, but each ruler proudly bore the title, Duke of Brunswick Lüneburg. By the late 17th century, the territories had consolidated into the Electorate of Brunswick Lüneburg, also known as the Electorate of Hanover, and the Principality of Brunswick Wolfenbüttel. This duchy has a thrilling tale to tell, a story of power, division and reunification, of ducal thrones and imperial politics. So let's dive into the rich history of this duchy and its numerous divisions and reunifications. The Duchy of Brunswick Lüneburg's story starts in 1235. With the intricate tapestry of medieval Europe as a backdrop, we find the duchy's origins rooted in the fertile lands of northwestern Germany. This was the era of knights and castles, of power struggles and political maneuverings. In the midst of it all, Otto the child of the illustrious House of Wealth was bestowed with a significant honor. The Duchy of Brunswick Lüneburg was granted to him as an imperial fief, a gift from the Holy Roman Emperor himself. Now, the House of Wealth was not a single unified entity, it was a complex network of familial lines, each with their own aspirations and ambitions. This complexity was mirrored in the duchy itself. Over time, the duchy was divided among various lines of the House of Wealth. Despite these divisions, each ruler, regardless of their specific line, was styled Duke of Brunswick Lüneburg. Imagine it, if you will. Each duke, whether they ruled over a large expanse of territory or a small corner of the duchy, bore the same title, the same dignity. It was a testament to the enduring prestige of the duchy and the house of wealth. But this was more than mere titles and formalities. The division of the duchy among the different lines of the house of wealth had profound implications. It set in motion a series of events that would shape the future of the duchy, the house of wealth, and even the very map of Europe itself. This set the stage for the intricate divisions and reunifications that would follow in the duchy's history. But that, dear listeners, is a tale for another time. Throughout its history, the Duchy of Brunswick Lüneburg experienced numerous divisions and reunifications. This statement couldn't be more apt as we delve into the complexities of this historical entity. The Duchy's story is a tapestry woven with threads of division and reunification, each strand representing a different line of the House of Wealth. The duchy, which emerged in the 13th century, saw numerous divisions amongst these lines, each ruler bearing the title Duke of Brunswick Lüneburg. History often seems like a game of thrones, and in the case of the duchy, this metaphor could not be more fitting. The duchy was divided among various lines of the House of Wealth, but this didn't mean the end. Rather, it was the beginning of a new chapter in the duchy's story. Fast forward to the late 17th century, the year 1692 to be precise. This year marked a critical turning point. The territories of the duchy had consolidated into two main entities. The Electorate of Brunswick Lüneburg, also known as the Electorate of Hanover, and the Principality of Brunswick Wolfenbüttel. This consolidation was more than just a merging of territories. It was a unification of power and influence under the House of Wealth. The Electorate of Brunswick Lüneburg became a key player in the political landscape of the time eventually leading to the Hanoverian branch of the family ascending to the thrones of Great Britain and Ireland in the early 18th century. Meanwhile, the Principality of Brunswick Wolfenbüttel held its own significance. It was a testament to the duchy's enduring legacy and the continuing influence of the House of Wealth. Interestingly, throughout this period of division and reunification, the seats of power shifted from Brunswick and Lüneburg to Chell and Wolfenbüttel, reflecting the dynamic nature of political power and the ever-changing landscape of the duchy. In a nutshell, the Duchy of Brunswick Lüneburg was a historical chameleon, constantly changing, dividing, and unifying. It was a living, breathing entity that evolved with the times, reflecting the complexities of history and the fascinating intricacies of power dynamics. These divisions and reunifications significantly shaped the duchy and its territories, they left an indelible mark on the landscape of Europe, and their impact continues to resonate in the annals of history. The Duchy of Brunswick Lüneburg, with its divisions and reunifications, is more than just a chapter in a history book. It's a testament to the enduring power of change, adaptation, and unity in the face of division. 
in 1714 a significant shift occurred with the Hanoverian succession. This marked the beginning of a new era for the Duchy of brunswick luneburg The Hanoverian branch of the House of Wealth, which had been ruling the Duchy, ascended to the thrones of Great Britain and Ireland. This was not just a matter of prestige, it was a powerful political move that significantly increased their influence and reach across Europe. This succession was not a mere swapping of crowns, it established a personal union with Hanover that lasted until 1837. This meant that the same monarch ruled over both Hanover and Great Britain and Ireland. It was a unique arrangement that intertwined the fates of these nations and shaped the political landscape of Europe for over a century. As we move forward to the early 19th century, we find another significant event that reshaped the duchy. The Congress of Vienna, held in 1814 and 1815, was a conference of ambassadors from major powers in Europe. This congregation was held in the aftermath of the Napoleonic Wars, with the aim to provide a long-term peace plan for Europe by settling critical issues arising from the French Revolutionary Wars and the Napoleonic Wars. The Congress of Vienna had a profound impact on the territories of the duchy. It led to a major territorial reshuffling as the Duchy of brunswick luneburg was divided into the Kingdom of Hanover and the Duchy of Brunswick. It was a momentous change, altering the political map of northwestern Germany. This was a turning point, leading to the creation of the Kingdom of Hanover and the Duchy of Brunswick. The Hanoverian succession and the Congress of Vienna were pivotal moments in the history of the Duchy of brunswick luneburg forever changing its trajectory. The Duchy of brunswick luneburgs history is a fascinating tale of power, divisions, and reunifications. As we wrap up this journey through time, Let's reflect on what we've learned. We delved into the emergence of the Duchy of brunswick luneburg in the year 1235 granted as an imperial fief to Otto the Child. We've seen how this historical duchy, situated in the northwestern part of Germany, evolved from the lands of the House of Wealth. The duchy's story is one of division and reunification. It was split amongst various lines of the House of Wealth, with each ruler bearing the title Duke of brunswick luneburg By the year 1692, the territories had consolidated into the Electorate of brunswick luneburg also known as the Electorate of Hanover, and the Principality of brunswick wolfenbuttel We also touched upon the Hanoverian succession, where, in the year 1714, the Hanoverian branch of the family ascended to the thrones of Great Britain and Ireland, ruling in personal union with Hanover until the year 1837. Lastly, we discussed the Congress of Vienna, a significant event that led to the territories becoming the Kingdom of Hanover and the Duchy of Brunswick post-1814. The Duchy had several branches, including Brunswick, Lundberg, Kallenberg, and Grubenhagen, each with their unique narratives woven into the rich tapestry of history. The seats of power shifted between Brunswick and Lundberg to Chell and Wolfenbüttel, reflecting the ever-changing dynamics of power and territory. The Duchy of brunswick luneburgs history is a testament to the ever-changing dynamics of power and territory. If you found this video informative, please subscribe to our channel and share it with your fellow history enthusiasts. Remember, knowledge is power. Until next time, keep exploring the past.